My name is Riku Sato, a high school student with no particular skills or talent, with a very introverted personality. Today, I am at an idol meet and greet with my friends. I'm surprised that Riku had tickets to this Koisuku meet and greet. Oh, they're such a popular idol group. I didn't know you liked idols, Riku. Well, yeah. Great job, Riku. Thanks to you, I can shake hands with my favorite idol, Momo Shimizu. Oh, I can't wait to meet her soon, my Momo. If you're after Momo Shimizu, she's probably at that booth. Wait for me, Momo. I'll be right there. As expected, a lot of people are gathered around Momo's booth. She's the center of the group, after all. Momo Shimizu is the most popular member of the popular idol group, Koizuku. She has captivated the hearts of boys all over Japan with her overwhelming singing and dancing talent. To top it off, her visuals are said to be a miracle, the kind of beauty you'd come across once in a thousand years. But... I'm a big fan of you, Momo. I stan you. Thanks. Same as always, huh? Due to her cool and collected personality, she could come across as cold and disinterested at times. However, it seems that her fans have accepted this aspect of her personality. <laughs> Momo, my love, I finally got to meet you! Get away from me, you're creepy. Momo thinks I'm creepy. <laughs> what a compliment. Ugh, you've had your turn, let's go. Just a bit longer. Just a bit longer. Rules are rules. Please leave. M Momo, my love. Please. There's all sorts of crazy out there. It's not easy being an idol. Especially when fans act like that. By the way, how did you manage to get a hold of these tickets? Uh, well, I got them from someone I know. Four tickets? I heard it's difficult to get one, let alone four. Is someone in the industry? Um, well... You can fool Charo, but you can't fool us. There's no secrets between us, remember? Okay, okay. I'll tell you the truth, but keep it between us, okay? Of course. Sounds like a deal. Long story short... What? what? Yes. I have a secret that no one can know. Uh, I'm home. So tired today. A wrong place. This is my room. The girl who is currently clinging to me is none other than Japan's most popular idol, Momo Shimizu. Momo and I actually are childhood friends and we grew up together. We are next door neighbors and our parents are also close. So whenever she has free time, she comes to my room to hang out. Plus... Hey, uh, hey, hey, pay attention to me. I'm busy. She acts completely different from her idol persona. She is very clingy, needy, and affectionate around me because Momo is not good at showing her emotions to people she is not close to. And this is why she is reserved when she is working as an idol. I do like that calm, collected, and reserved version of Momo because it works for her idol persona. But I also think that she should smile since she is an idol after all. Oh, I almost forgot. Why didn't you come to the meet and greet event today? I even gave you four tickets. Uh, no, I went. But you didn't come to my booth? The line was so long, I didn't bother. Why? We can shake hands anytime, so I gave the tickets to my friends. They were all so excited. Aww, I was really looking forward to seeing you at my booth, Riku. I'm angry. Hey, you're too close. I won't move from here until you give me some attention. Okay, okay. Are you happy now? <laughs> Very much. Gosh, she's too cute. In addition, Momo has other tricks up her sleeves so that I would spoil her. Shouldn't you go home, Momo? It's already night. Momo is currently sleeping. Momo will just stay over for the night. Yeah, yeah, you're still awake. Come on, go home. Aww, how did 
you know I was still awake? You thought that you'd actually get away with it? The next morning. Oh, uh... Good morning, Miku. What? What, what are you doing? Sleeping next to you. That, that's not what I meant. Why are you here? I missed you so much that I woke up early and came here. Oh, you're so... As you can see, Momo really likes me. I'm aware that the way she feels about me is more than a childhood friend, and I'm happy about it too. But Momo is a famous idol. We can't date, and we can't let anyone else see us like this. And so, the only place we can spend time together is within this house. If I wasn't an idol, I could spend more time with you, Riku. But you chose to be an idol because you enjoy it, right? Yeah, but you're the reason why I'm an idol, Riku. Oof. That's right. Momo became an idol because of me. The story goes back to our childhood. Riku, I want to be your bride when I grow up. Huh? You? My bride? Am I not good enough? Of course not. Uh, why not? I'm going to marry a beautiful idol. What if I become an idol? Will you take me as your bride? Huh? I will work hard to become your bride. I wanted to be a little mean and blurted out those words, but those words ended up encouraging Momo into pursuing the idol career path. After that, Momo asked her parents to let her attend an idol training school, and she continued to work hard in all of her lessons. At last, while in middle school, she achieved her dream of debuting as an idol. Riku, I became an idol! I can't believe you actually did it. Congratulations! At first I was working hard so I can marry you, but now I actually enjoy being an idol. I see. I'm glad to hear that. At first, Momo had an ulterior motive to being an idol. But now, uh, through her interactions with other members in the group and with the fans, she engages in her idol activities at her own will. I know how hard she works behind the scenes. I love Momo for giving her all in her idol activities. But if you hadn't just said that, I wouldn't be where I am now. Thank you for making me into an idol. You're welcome. This is my secret that no one else can know. One day... I came early today, so I'll surprise Riku. I'm home. Oh, he's here. Come in. It's pretty empty, though. Hmm? Hello! Hmm, not a bad room. What do you want to do? Play cards or games? Um, you came over to study, right? Huh? Huh? Who are they? Riku's friends? Hmm. I'm studying with my friends today, so please don't come over. It might cause a commotion if they find out. Sorry. Why didn't he tell me earlier? One hour later. I'm tired of studying. Let's talk about our love life. Huh? Uh, no. I'm interested in your love life, Riku. Me too! You guys. So, Riku, do you like anyone? Uh, no. Oh, come on! Tell us the truth! I am telling the truth. I don't like anyone. End of story. No way. Hmm? Ron. Hmm, I see. Oh, right. I forgot I have something to do today. Well, I guess we'll leave now. Oh, okay. What? Why? I haven't even talked about my love life yet. No one needs to know about your love life. Take care, guys. Yes. Oh, Riku. Hmm? <laughs> Sometimes you need to put your feelings into words. Huh? See you. Feelings into words? Huh. What? Momo, when did you get here? Don't tell me you came in through the window again. I told you to stop doing that. It's dangerous. I'm leaving. Huh? What's wrong with her? Since then, Momo stopped coming over altogether. She used to come over every day, but she's so distant now, both in person and in text. What's going on? One day... Hey, Riku, do you know where Momo went? Uh, what do you mean? Momo hasn't come home today and they can't get a hold of her. Are you serious? Momo is missing. 
I am going to look for her. Hello? I have a favor to ask. <sighs> I knew I'd find you here. Riku, why did you... This used to be your go-to spot whenever something happened to you. The park where we used to play. The park where you proposed to me. So, what happened now? I have nothing to say to a liar. Liar? What do you mean? You aren't going to marry me, right? Even though we promised. Huh? That's not true. Liar! The other day when your friend asked if you liked anyone, you said no. Huh? How do you know that? Because I heard it while hiding in the closet. Why were you hiding in the closet? That's not important right now. Anyway, I understand why you're so angry now, but that was... Oh? Oh? Is that my darling Momo that I see over there? <laughs> what are the chances of us meeting here like this? It's that annoying fan from the handshake event. Who is he? I heard rumors that you were spotted around here, so I staked out the place. I'm a fan club member. My membership number is 15. My name is Kato. Nice to meet you. Oh, you're a fan. Thank you very much. <laughs> Momo recognized my existence. I'm at peak happiness. As proof of our fateful reunion, I want a handshake. Um, well, I'm not working right now. Come on, don't be a party pooper. Sorry, no. Aw, Momo is so shy, but that's cute too. <laughs> well, I guess I'll show you how it's done. What? Uh -huh. Enough. Huh? Enough is enough. If you are a true fan, respect Momo's boundaries. Huh? Who are you? Momo Shimizu's first fan. Oh, here we go. The fan who claims to have a long history of loving Momo. What matters is the amount of love, not the history. Your love is a one-way street. Grrr. What is going on? That's the weird person who was at the meet and greet event. Huh? Who's that girl who looks just like Momo? Guys, give me a hand. Yes, yes sir. sir. I'm going to hurt anyone who gets in the way of my romance with Momo. You're not a fan. We don't tolerate idiot stalkers. Hello? Is this the police? There's a suspicious person in Koiwa Park. What? No way. It's the real Momo. What's your relationship with her? And why didn't you say anything? Because I didn't want this to happen. All this commotion. You see, Momo? That's why I said I didn't like anyone that day. Oh, I see. What's with this girl? She's too strong. You don't stand a chance against me. Don't underestimate my martial arts skills. Oh, by the way, this is self-defense. This is the police. Where's the suspicious person? This way. Well then, we'll get going. We'll tell the police about everything, so don't worry about it. See you later, Momo. Thanks again, everyone. Thank you so much. You have great friends. Right? Weren't you scared earlier? Your opponent was much bigger than you, and you've always been timid and not good at sports, right? Yeah, it was a bit intimidating, but I'm training myself so that I can protect you when the time comes. Um... The person I love is an idol. I have to work hard too, right? <sighs> I... I won't believe it unless you say it clearly in your own words. You're right. Sorry. You'd better be. Momo, I love you. <gasps> I've been in love with you for a long time, but I also don't want to get in the way of your career. That's why I'll wait until you are satisfied with your career. And when that time comes, I want to propose to you. You finally said it. Sorry for making you wait. Well... Until that time comes, please support me by my side. Of course. And so the misunderstanding that originated from something very trivial was resolved. The troublemaking fan turns out he collected personal information on various idols through social media and harassed them repeatedly. Because of this, he was arrested.
Since his arrest, Momo became even more dedicated to her idol career. It is said among fans that Momo has been smiling more than before. So, let me introduce her again. This is my childhood friend, Momo. Nice to meet you all. Momo, I missed you! I am so honored to meet the great Momo Shimizu. Momo in real life! Oh my gosh, you're so cute and pretty! I'm grateful to my friends who helped me out. Since then... Hey, say you love me. Again? Hurry up! I... I love you. <laughs> Momo loves Riku too. Uh, since then, Momo became even more openly affectionate and needy. Frankly, she is too cute, and the way she expresses love towards me has been leaving me in a state of constant fluster. I realize that from now on, I will also need to work on my patience. Hi, it's me, Mel. Thanks for watching my channel. I'm super happy if you watch the next and other videos too.